Hey everybody, it's um, Saturday afternoon here in Chicago and it's unseasonably warm. It's like upper 40s. Temperature's going to drop tomorrow uh, by 20 degrees. So um, I was able to get out and do a couple things today, but I wanted to get back to my business. And I wanted to record a short video on Facebook marketing. And I can record 50 videos on Facebook marketing, but I wanted to attack one particular issue. As you know, I am uh, associated with uh, the Conversion Pros, and there'll be a link at the bottom of the screen or in my profile. And it is by far the best tool to get traffic, leads, conversions, and sales. It is a fantastic resource, but that's not the purpose of the video even though I often happen to mention it in most of my videos because that's how good it is. I've been around 17 years and some years I made a lot of money, some years just average money, but so I know what tools work and what don't. So anyway, part of the resources that you get um, is all kinds of resources to learn how to market to get your own leads and traffic and sales and conversions. A tool's perfect, but if you can't get leads then um, it's not as effective so what this program does over others it teaches you how to get those leads uh, first before you can convert them so anyway one of the main uh, areas of marketing today is social media and Facebook is one of them but I wanted to point out something that people continue to do wrong 100% wrong is posting in Facebook groups. Let me show you. So let me go over here on my Facebook and I want to pull up a particular thread. So here's kind of uh, a group called Work From Home Opportunities and I'm going to pull that up for everybody. And it's just a standard Facebook group. That's all it is. Uh, you can post opportunities. Now there are advantages to Facebook groups okay there's no question about it it is a marketing tool it is not a tool that should be ignored however some people are just spinning their wheels and wasting their time there are many many aspects to Facebook marketing whether it is social engagement um, liking sharing uh, pics or sayings or inspirational videos or even opportunities but in this particular thread I wanted to really point out so th this group's just called work from home opportunity there's thousands of them okay and there's also a tool uh, several that will post to like three four hundred Facebook groups at a time now that's all well and good and I'm not saying you will never get any traffic from that because you can and I have but a couple mistakes. People automatically think Facebook and then they go to these groups and post. So if you can see as I'm scrolling, see this long thread? So this is either quite ingenious by the person or they were actually looking for an opportunity. I'm going to tell you why. Okay. So let's scroll back up here. So this person, and again, not calling anybody out, I just it's also a learning tool for them. Who has real work from home opportunities that's really real? Now you get these periodically um, in these Facebook groups, but what's interesting is not necessarily this person asking the question because that's not really relevant because she's might be, uh, new to Facebook, new to a work at home opportunity, and you know, is really sincere about trying to find out something about this program. So, I even made a post in it. So, as you can see, it was 15 hours ago, there's already 58 likes, and then you see the number of people that have posted their opportunity. Okay. So, as you can see, it's, it's, and I'm not going to attack any person that's posting every opportunity, but it's almost overwhelming for the person that there's really no focus. 
And as you can see, it, it will go on and on and on. And I even made a post because your reactionary impulse is to say, hey, my opportunity is better than any of these. Now, there's some decent ones in here, but there's also some bad ones, that ones don't, that don't work. And, and part of that's my experience being in the business. Um, but look at how many people post it. Now, what's interesting about this is it just goes on and on and on and on. And, you know, some people will use, you know, their money screenshots. This is what I made. And they'll just post and post and post. And I'm trying to think to myself, is this person or any of the people that visit this group, are they actually going to go through all this and sign up? So, for example, I posted my link. Now, that's 15 hours ago. I haven't gotten a look. I haven't gotten a sign up. Um, and I'll attack what you need to post and how you post in another video. But as you can see, it just goes on and on and on. And I wonder what her reaction is when she sees all these opportunities. And I, and we're still not at the end. So it's a full-time job to go through all of these. And everybody said, $2,000 guaranteed. Oh, this is going to make you a million dollars. Oh, earn up to $500 daily on autopilot. I mean, it just goes on and on. I still haven't gotten to the end of it. Okay, we're getting close. Uh, make $4,700 profit in 11 days, okay? And, and again, I'm not going to, I'm not someone who's going to call anybody out because the person who posted this might have made this money. You see, even somebody put a screenshot here. So we're almost actually at the end. So if we scroll really back up, let me see. I don't remember how many there were. There was like over 150 or 170. So what's interesting is, um, is I'm going to hit the discussion here. And computer a little slow today, but I want to kind of reload the page. And as you can see, when people, you know, they just post yesterday, one hour ago, and Facebook's kind of funky. It'll go from one hour to 19 hours ago, and then, you know, 22 hours ago, and then 42 minutes, you know, they have this recent activity. So, but as you can see, um, you know, hers just comes up. Basically, I'm halfway down, as you can see, my scroll over here. And it just goes on and on and on. So anyway, these groups is thousands and thousands of posts, okay? So let me tell you a little value here. And as you can see, look at the number of members here, 161,000. So this is a big one, okay? Now... If you're spending your time on Facebook groups, posting to 500 groups, there's no question you might get a sign up. You might get a couple signups. There's no question about it at all. Okay? I mean, there's 3,800 new people here. So there's 3,800 targets because what people sometimes do is do reverse advertising. They'll say, no, I never tried this, but try this. So there's this is one of the real big ones. So if you make a post, okay, it's going to be gone within an hour. So then that takes somebody to scroll like I was doing to find it, to see it, to click on a link, and maybe get a sign up for a tour or whatever. Okay? Now, I will post to a few groups each and every day. Okay? And honestly, I don't have a Facebook tool to post to 300 groups. Okay? So you could multiply your efforts. I just don't think that's a, that's the wisest investment for money if it's 50 bucks, 40 bucks, whatever it is. This should only be a small part of your marketing. And anybody who's friends with me on Facebook, you'll see that I'll post because it gives updates. You know, I'll post 9, 10 groups a day. And sometimes you get some action, but it's really more about branding your name. Hey, Jeff Kasmer, I saw that name before, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So I just wanted to kind of show you how Facebook marketing, sometimes people waste their time um, and posting because, especially some of these larger groups, it's actually counterproductive. So from a branding perspective, you might get some looks, hey, I recognize that name. If you're consistent about your efforts, you post in groups each and every day and they see your name, there's one or two things going to happen. 
one, I recognize that guy, or two, I'm sick of you, which is okay. It's not like you're going out for coffee, but I, I want you to understand that there's all kinds of groups. So I'm just going to like put work at home and then I'm going to see all results for work at home. And then when you go over here, you can just go to groups. Okay. So as you can see, I'm a member of a couple of them, a couple of big ones. Okay. And then you have groups and groups and groups. Some big groups, some I joined, some I haven't joined. Now, I know there are people that have literally joined every single one of them. So just for the purpose of this video, I'm going to join a couple. All right. But keep in mind, when you post to 148,000, and as you can see, somebody set up the group to approve me because I'm right here. I'm already approved. Okay. Uh, work from home opportunity. So let's go to this one real quick. And you'll always get this message. Okay. I'm glad to be part of this group. So let's, so let's, I'm going to uh, scroll down real quick all the way to the bottom five hours. So as you can see, there are many, many people in this group and posting. So anyway, I just want to kind of say that the bottom line of this is Facebook marketing is a great tool, but it is not an end all tool. You should do post in a few groups each day, but 500 groups. No, that's it. Take care. We'll see you next time.